Hello. Today, the Jason explanation explains love, sex, and marriage. Not, I've been asked to say, necessarily in that order. Not on the BBC, anyway. Well, this is going to be an informative programme. At least I'm going to learn something. You see, nobody ever told me about sex. They told me about love. They told me about marriage. They told me about the birds and the bees. <laughs> but not a word about sex. Hmm. I wonder what bees tell their baby bees. My little bee. Mummy, yes. where do baby bees come from? Oh, uh, go and play with the daisies, eh? No, Mummy, Mummy. Yes, yes, my little mummy. bee. Mummy, Bertha yes. Bee says she's got a big, great big sperm of Oh, you and she... dirty little bee. Oh, you've been mixing with the drones, haven't you? No, no, no. Mummy, what, what is sex? No, we don't use words like that in bee land. Nice bees call it the birds and the humans. Oh, birds and the humans. Mm. Which one am I? Humans are the people we rent the hive from. Oh, I see. And they make little bees, do they? No, no, they make little humans. Oh, can I make little humans too, then? No, you can't. Oh, why not, Mummy? No, Please, you I can't. want it. Why can't, can't I want it? Just, just you. listen. I'll explain it. Yes, yes, go Ready? on. Ready? Yes. Good. When humans make babies, yes. they go upstairs into their bedroom. Can't they make babies in bungalows? Yes. No, no. Oh, yes. Yes, of course they can make babies in bungalows. So, really, they could stay downstairs and make babies in the lounge? Well, if they wanted to. Oh. But it wouldn't be nice. Oh, wouldn't it? No. Oh. So, they go yeah. upstairs. Yes. And they take off their clothes. Yes, yes, mummy, mummy, mummy. Yes. Yes, what, what, what are clothes? Clothes are what humans take off to make babies. Oh, how do I take my clothes off, Mummy? Bees, right. bees, bees don't have any clothes. Oh, so I can't make babies then? Yes, of course you can. Oh, well, no, clothes. Oh, yes. Listen, yes. clothes are what humans put on to make each other want to take them off. Oh. Then the mummy and the daddy get onto the mummy, mummy, mummy. Yes. Mommy. yes. What, what, is, what is a daddy? A daddy is what you will be when you're older. About, oh, about ten days older. Oh, did, you, did you and I have a daddy, Mummy? Yes. Where's he now, then, Mummy? Uh, well, he's dead. Oh, he's mm. dead. Why, why yes. did he die, then, Mummy? Well, uh, because baby bees only have dead daddies. Oh, mm. oh. Mm. oh, why, why, why is that? Why do they only have dead well, ones? Well, uh... Well, you see, my little yes. bee, yes. every time big bees make baby bees, yes. the mummy kills the daddy. Oh, oh I yes. see. Yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> oh, I think I'll go and play with the daisies after all. <laughs> I may be gone some time. <sighs> Darling, mm -hmm. was that your first time? Well, yes, yes it was. <laughs> Darling, mm. was that your first time? Well, well actually, yes, it was. <laughs> Wasn't it beautiful? Wonderful. Oh, unforgettable. I suppose, I suppose we did do it right. Well, of course we did. Didn't we? Hmm? Well, how should I know? It was my first time. Well, it was my first time, too. Well, no, I thought you might have read about well, it. There's no point in asking me after all. I mean, your implication was it was my no, second time. Yeah. I first... <laughs> is like an ocean and that it just rolls on and on our tide is always coming in it's passionate and strong yes our love is like a sea always heaving never still i wonder if that could be why i always feel so ill oh, oh, oh a hug and a kiss, kiss. Like a duel, like a challenge, like a bout. Our love is like a boxing match, really knocks me out. Our love is like a bullfight, it takes away my breath. I wonder if that could be why I end up bored to death. A 
rhapsody for two. I am the melody, and the harmony is you. Yes, our love, it reached just like the song. There are no ifs or buts. We, we wonder if that, that could be why we hate each other's guts. Now, I'm lucky. I am incredibly good looking and attractive to women. I, it's, it's, no, don't, get off. No, don't, Sheila, she get off later. Later. <clears throat> See? See what... Darling, do you love me? Hmm? Yeah, yeah, of course I do. Well, go on, say it then. Say you love me. Say it, go on. Mm, I'll love you. No, louder, louder. I love you. No, louder still. Come on. I love you. I love you, you nagging old bat. Now, why don't you leave me alone and shut your ugly face? He loves me. Oh, well, Mr. I feel so embarrassed. Oh, there's no need to be embarrassed, Winnie. We're an engaged couple. It's perfectly natural. Well, yes, that's what you keep saying. No, no, I mean, Winnie, buying a double bed is perfectly natural. The people here won't be embarrassed. This is a bed shop. They're used to people buying beds. But I still feel silly. Oh, Winnie, couples like us do it all the time. Yes, that's what you keep saying, too. Oh, shh, shh. Someone's coming over to us. Oh, now, j just, just behave normally, yes. as if it's a, a quite normal shopping trip. <laughs> Afternoon, Squire. Afternoon. What you got your eyes on, then? I mean, beside your young lady's legs. I beg your pardon? Well, it's got to be a bed, hasn't it? I mean, that's all we sell here, beds, beds, beds. Oh, blimey, sometimes I think everyone's at it. <laughs> Buying beds, I mean. Yeah, well, Sorry. Uh, uh, we uh, want a double bed. Very wise, Squire, very wise. Plenty of room for a roll, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Plenty of room for a... Married, are you? Married? Uh, uh, yeah, well, in we're engaged. engaged. Ah, yeah. then you're very wise to anticipate the happy day, just as long as you don't infanticipate it. <laughs> Get it infanticipate if you don't infant. Come over here and have a deco at this one. Now, look at this. Look, this is a real solid job, this one. You see? It looks very, very nice. It does look nice. Mm. Interior sprung. Yes, I am, love. Are you? No, uh, I, no, what I mean is, is it comfortable? Well, there's only one way to find out, isn't it? Climb on, love. Go on, jump on, have a go. No, no come, come on, come on, get on, go on. No, no, why, why not? Oh, what about people looking at me through the window? Oh, yes, sorry, sorry, forgot about it. Hang on a sec, hang on, just a sec. Boy, folks, come on, roll up for a good laugh. Watch the young lady test her marriage bed. Roll up, 50 p.m. I said, I said, I said, stop that, stop that at once. No, I said, just close that door. Sorry, what? Really? This is too bad. You're embarrassing my fiancé. No, no, sorry, sorry, Squire. I didn't mean to do that, but really the young lady should test the bed. If you'll excuse me. <clears throat> yeah, darling, uh, how about, you know, come on, jump on the bed. Jump in the bed, eh? It's just for me. Eh? Go on, you know, Jane, go on, come on. It's all right. Oh, 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 that's very comfy. Yes, yeah, that's right, but don't just lie there, love. You don't have to think of England these days. Go on, give it a good bounce up and down. Go on, go on. Go on, bounce. <laughs> Love a double bed? Yeah, quite right, love. Quite right. Uh, go on, there you go. Now bounce together. Bounce together. Go on. <laughs> excuse me, I say, excuse me. Yes, Squire? Shouldn't, shouldn't it be me on the bed with my fiancé and not you? Oh, sorry, quite right. Go on, then on you get. Go on, have a bounce together. Go on, have a good bounce together. Oh, go on. Oh, Off you oh, go. That's very nice. <laughs> yeah. oh. Excuse me. Are you two what I call a modern couple? Oh, yes, I think so. Right, then, we'd better try it with three. Move over, love. Now, let's all bounce together, right, Gamma? Bounce. 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 Oh. Hey. Oh. Bounce. Oh. Bounce. Oh. Bounce. Oh. Bounce. Oh. Bounce. Take the bed. Look, can him deliver it today, please? Yes, certainly, sir. I'll be with you this afternoon. Fine. Well, come oh, on, Winnie. <laughs> just a moment, Ernest. That's fair. What do you mean, Winnie? Well, we've bought a bed for me. Yes, Winnie. Now, it's only fair that we buy one for you to use. Darling, let us run away together. Let us leave behind all our old ties, all this routine way of life. Let us find a new life together, free, unfettered, just... Darling, just name the day. All right, darling. What about Thursday? Ah, no. Calm Thursday. Darts match. So, where are we? We've met the one love of our life. We've married him or her. And now we're deliriously happy. Why are we so happy? Because already we're tasting the joys of infidelity. <laughs> I think I bought that rather well. John? Yes, Felicity? Last night, 
You mean last night? Yes, last night, during the party. You were in the dining room embracing Lavinia Basingstoke against the sideboard. You... no? Yes. I heard the drawers squeaking. And in your pocket last night, I found a Brighton hotel bill for last weekend, when you said you'd be in Birmingham. The bill was for Mr. and Mrs. John Smith. How do you know it was mine? Your name is John Smith. Yes, of course. And sometime last night, John, while I was asleep, you went along to the au pair's room. How did you know that? Because when I woke this morning, you were still there. Oh, yes, of course. Now, John, Hmm? I want to ask you a question, and I want you to answer me honestly. Yes, Felicity. Are you being unfaithful? No, Felicity, no, 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 a thousand times, no, no. So you admit it? Yes, 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 yes. Oh, is that all you can say? Yes. Then let me say this, John. In the past, you've made me a very happy woman. Oh, Felicity. Once in 1959... And then again in 1964. And in 1972, you made me a moderately happy woman. Oh, you mean when... Yes, when you shaved off your moustache. God, can you ever forgive me? I can forgive, but I can't forget. You can, Felicity, you can. After all, you forgot about me and Linda Bunsworth. Who's Linda Bunsworth? You see, you've forgotten about her. No, John, you never told me about Linda Bunsworth. Well, then it was Celia Wilson or Amanda Hemingway or... Well, one of them. I mean, what does it matter? What does it matter, he says. <laughs> what does it matter? Oh, God! What does it matter? <laughs> well, what does it matter? It matters, because... Oh, never mind. Well, tell me, tell me, dear. No, no, it doesn't matter. Oh, John, will things ever be the same again between us? Only if... Yes, John. <laughs> Only if... Only if your husband and my wife agree to another swap. Darling, I have to tell you, I don't think I can marry you. But you must, darling, you must. I can't live without you. But I can't, I can't. Please, darling, please, put me out of my misery. Very well. (laughs) Ah, ah, Thank you, darling. Ah. 